Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to Core Monsters. Today we are in Rosemont, Illinois. We're going to be doing our first ever arena event. Going to racing today, we have eight trucks lined up, ready to put on a show for you and compete for the wins. Up first, we're going to have Flying High, driven by Henry Gibbons. Now this is straight line racing. Say so here we go, up and over, onto the cars, and across the line with a 2.908. For Henry and flying high. Good solid pass there for him. Next up we're going to see James Whitaker in Eagle Eye. This is a nice looking little pickup here. Let's see how well he can do here on this straight line track. He's going to run 2.995. Not quite as fast as flying high but still a very nice clean pass. Now we're going to see DJ Payne in King Carnage. I believe this is our first time seeing this truck on the tour so far, so let's see how this goes. Up and over, big wheelie on the pass, three flat. So that's actually our third slowest time of the night so far, but that's all right. Next we're going to see Damon Newton in Napa Auto Parts. We know he can be a threat. Up and over. Across the line, we have a 3.082. Just seems like we're getting slower as the day goes on, but hey, you know what? That's how it goes sometimes. Next up, Jack Schroeder in Try Me. Looking for a racing win. He has a freestyle win already, but he wants that racing win to go with it. Good leave off the line across 2.88. That will be our top time of the night so far. Can he hang on to it, especially with this guy coming up with Rat Trap? Randall Boone, we know this truck's fast. Him and his teammate Cottonmouth have been on a tear. Off the line, oh, he misses the cars. That is going to be a DQ. No time for Randall Boone. That is unfortunate because that was fast. All right, now we're going to see Mike Maxwell in loud pedal. We're going to get staged up here. There's the light up and over. Here we go. 961 a good pass from loud pedal that should be number two so far I believe next up Lonnie Hall and Cottonmouth he won both racing and freestyle at the last show he was at so he's going for more let's see if he can get it oh big wheelie off the line and across 2.699 what a pass beautiful run for Cottonmouth I believe that is the winner. Yes, it is. Here are our standings for racing. We have a Cottonmouth with a 2.699. Try Me with a 2.888. Flying High with a 2.908. Loud Pedal with a 2.961. Eagle Eye with a 2.995. King Carnage with a 3 flat. Napa with a 3.082. And Rat Trap with a disqualification due to missing the cars. That was a great racing show. Next up, we're going to have freestyle. Now, today, I need to have everyone bear in mind that these runs will only be a minute long. We are doing that because of the smaller venue. Next, now, we're going to see James Whitaker and Eagle Eye starting us out. Keep in mind, we're going to see a little bit lower momentum. Good first hit there for James. Now, keep in mind, we're going to see some lower momentum and stuff like that here at this show. Just being a smaller venue, these guys want to make sure they're on damage anything a slow roll up and over the little whoop section there around tight real close to the wall good air off the racing lane there 30 seconds remaining go across the wall back up the back side of the cars good little wheelie off the cars there Well, it looks like somebody in the crowd is going to take a bumper home with him today. Very nice hit off the racing lane there as well. Around, we're going to go back over the whoops section. Hits the back side of the racing lane there. I don't know if that was on purpose, the way he hit it. And looks like time's going to be up, so this hit actually may not count, but he's going to run right across the vans. Almost got stuck up there. Score of 17 for James and Eagle Eye. It's a very nice run to start off with. Next, we're going to see Damon Newton in Napa Auto Parts. We have seen him freestyle and have some unfortunate results with breaking the truck early. So let's see if he can keep it together this time. 
Good Sky Willie off the cars. Great start. Let's see if we can keep that going because that was a beautiful first hit. Slow roll, then good air off the pod over the car, or off the ramp over the cars. It was very nice. Goes back around, we're gonna roll up over the whoop section here a little bit. Get a little bit of air off one of them, I like it. Good utilization of what he has out there on the track. Using the racing lane to go up and over 30 seconds left. Definitely getting a bunch of hits in in the time. Going for donuts, very nicely done for Damon. Might be some of the best donuts we've seen so far on the tour. Very, very well done. Great control. Nice Sky Willie over the cars. Went back around. We're going for the racing lane again. Very nice. Whoops around. Time is up, so the rest of this will be for the fans. It was a very good run for Damon with a score of 16. Can't quite take down Eagle Eye, but still a very good run. All right, we're going to see our first freestyle from DJ Payne and King Carnage. I've heard rumors that this guy is kind of a nut behind the wheel, so this could be good. Good air off the ramp there. Tried to clear all that. Whip around, racing lane. Not a lot of air off the racing lane. I don't know if he just didn't have a good run up or didn't fully commit. Come back around. Get a little wheelie off the cars. Okay. Got a little close to the wall there, so he had to really kind of stay out of it. Up and over. Nice wheelie off the car. Gets across the top of the van. Very nice. We are within 30 seconds remaining. Going up over the whoop section again. Oh, man. Look at that. It takes break a steering ram or something off the front of the truck the way it hit that ramp there we go good air off the racing lane five seconds remaining whipping around he's trying to get something in using those whoops just to try and create something in the last few seconds very good run for dj Payne and king carnage looks like he's just going to show off a little bit for the fans he's having fun out here score of 17 he will tie eagle eye for the lead right now. A lot of big trucks coming though. Next up, Henry Gibbons and Flying High. We've got high expectations here. Gonna roll out slow. Right to the cars, good. Sky Willie off the cars. Turns it around, going to the racing lane. He's gonna roll over the first one, then use the second ramp to get some air. Very nice. Rolls over the whoops here. Good air off of that third little little whoop there. Solid hit on the racing lane. Going for the back side of the cars. No, we're not. We're going for the back side of the van stack. Very nice, huge wheelie up and over. Beautifully done for Henry. We have 20 seconds remaining. What's he going to do to follow up that hit? Gonna go for a big hit on the racing lane. Awkward. Oh, he's up. He's over. Oh, no. Score 15 for Henry and flying high. Got an awkward bounce off the triple ramps there, the whoop section. That was unfortunate. Now we're gonna see Randall Boone in Rat Trap. He's probably pretty upset after disqualifying and racing, so I would expect to see some hard throttle inputs here out of this truck. Good Sky Willie off the racing lane. Whipping back around real quick. Going right for the van stack early. Up and over. Very nice. Comes down pretty clean. Up and over the little whoop section. Good solid hit off of that. Taking no time. Beautiful hit. Throwing this truck around the venue. He knows how to control it. He's a very capable driver. Huge wheelie up and over the van. Almost as good as flying highs, but not quite. Look back around. Good air off the whoop section. He's going to have to back it up here, though. Lost quite a bit of time there. Just too much momentum. Couldn't get it woed up in time. 
There we go. Good. Wheelie off the cars. That's the end of the run. So anything else he does is not scorable. We're going to wait for the results to come in. Almost in the wall, but good air. He's going to whip it around and park it. Score of 18 for Randall Boone and Rat Trap. That is our new leader going into the next run, which is going to be Mike Maxwell in loud pedal. We've seen this truck run a couple of weeks ago, or last week, I believe it was, actually. He had a pretty good showing. Beautiful wheelie off the car, up over the van. Man, he came out with a purpose on that one. He knew what he wanted to do, and he went right for it. Good air off the racing lane. They call it loud pedal for a reason, because he knows how to keep that pedal down and loud. Very nice across the center of the track there. Around. Get some air off the racing lane. Very nicely done. 30 seconds remaining. Wasting no time going from hit to hit. Beautiful, beautiful air. So he changed his mind on which direction he wanted to go there. It's all right. We're going to go back to the van stack. Oh, we caught the car, but we're going to get up and over anyways. Very nice. Not giving up. Five seconds remaining. He's struggling to get it turned around here, though. Is he going to get one more? And he is. He's going to get a good solid hit into the back of the van. Man, they're going to have to bring out a new van. That thing is destroyed. Score of 18 is going to tie Randall Boone. It's a very, very good run for Loud Pedal. Next, we're going to see Lonnie Hall in Cottonmouth. He doubled down, I believe it was three weeks ago, two weeks ago at his first show. He wants to do it again. Can he, though? Tries to get a little power wheelie up and over the cars, but not quite with the power wheelie, but still a good solid hit. Going right to the van. Up and over. Very vertical. A little bit of a power wheelie off the bottom, too, or slap wheelie, I'm sorry. I'm gonna whip it around. Good air. Really utilizing all the power that truck has in it just to keep that front end in the air and keep everybody watching. Really entertaining run. Way to get a couple of hits in there. We're within 30 seconds. Feels like it's been 10. He's just blowing through it. It's beautiful. Very, very nicely done. Going for some donuts here. We're going to get some nice donuts in too. Going to pull out of it. Very nice up over the racing lane. Looks like the run is going to end here. I don't know if they're going to count the next hit. I don't believe they will, but very nice up on its tailgate. Beautiful run. Score of 20 for Cottonmouth. That is a new leader. What a run. Now we're going to see Jack Schroeder and Try Me coming out. That is a big bar to follow. He would love to get another freestyle win after falling just shy and racing. Beautiful first hit. But Cottonmouth set a really high bar there. Lonnie really threw that truck around nicely. Nice wheelie over the racing lane cars. Beautifully done. Gonna cross thread across the whoop section. Up to the van stack. Up. Very nice wheelie off the car, but can't quite get over the stack. That'll probably hurt him a little bit compared to what we've seen over that van stack today. 30 seconds remaining. Good air off the racing lane for Jack and Try Me here. Whipping it back around to the whoops section. He's going to get a little air off the last one there. I don't know right now. It doesn't feel like it's just going to be enough for, for what Lonnie was doing. Good air on the racing lane, though. He's trying. He just he needs some wow moment or something to really set him apart from the crowd here. And he just I don't think he's gonna have that. Looks like the end of the run there, actually. So scores are gonna be in. This is for the fans. Beautiful up and over the van, though. He had to go back to it and try again. Very nicely done. Is he gonna end it with some donuts? No, he's not. The diff opens up on him. Can't pull it out. Score of 17 for try me. Was a very good run, but it just was not enough here today. Our final results in freestyle are going to be Cottonmouth with a 20, Loud Pedal with an 18, Rat Trap with an 18, Eagle Eye, King Carnage, and Try Me all with a 17. 
Napa with a 16, and Flying High with a 15. This was a great show here today in Rosemont. Good driving by everybody. Racing was close, but the big standout here was Cottonmouth in freestyle, really just showing off what that truck's capable of. Anyways, guys, y'all have a good day. I'm going to sign off here. We will see you next week in Minneapolis, Minnesota. I hope y'all join us.